how do we think about the organization? Well, we start off with strategy. What is the strategy? Now, the strategy is how are we going to win? What are the building blocks in our, our, our plan for winning? And that translates into our outcomes, the results, the scores on the doors. It's the organizational system that translates the theory of the strategy into the outcome of the result. And I'm going to go into details as to exactly what is in that box, the organization as a system. So let's unpack this organization as a system. You have your strategy and you have your business outcome. What's in the middle? Well, we start with people. Who are the people you employ? Now, this could, could be contractors as well, or suppliers, but it's human beings who are gonna do work. Now, the way we organize people is they are in positions, and positions are broken into roles. And it's important to understand the distinction between a role and a position. A role has purpose. It's, they do the same work and have the same sets of competencies and drive the same outcomes. You design the roles. Positions are planned over time. Um, I could have an HR business partner is the role, but an HR business partner for supply chain or finance is the position. The organization is broken into three elements. There is the objectives, and the, which is the outcomes you want to achieve. There is the activities, the work you need to do. And there are the competencies, the skills, the behaviors that you need to execute effectively to be able to do that work so you can achieve those outcomes. At the role level, we set the targets. What are the target outcomes, the objectives that need to be achieved? What are the KPIs that need to be uh, adhered to? What are the milestones that you want to deliver? What are the accountabilities? What are you responsible for? And what are the skills, the proficiency levels to be effective at that? Those are the targets. People have actuals, people supply competencies. They have skills and what have you that don't always match those targets and therefore there are gaps. People do work. How much time do people spend doing what? Are they doing the right work? We don't always do that. And what are you actually achieving? So this is the Augusta system. These six components of people, position, roles, objectives, activities, and competencies. And we link all of this together through data. 